Hello guys, welcome back to Divine Time and Tarot. This is Tanya. If you are new to the channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. Cross Rockers, you're always welcome. Good morning, good afternoon, Divine Time and Tarot family. Welcome, 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 new subscribers. I love you guys. I truly appreciate you. Y'all been holding me down. Y'all have, y'all been holding me down. I'm almost at that 10,000 subscribers, so I'm going to be giving away free readings. I will give you all the information when this goes down in the community, on the community board, so you will know when it's going down, okay, as soon as I hit that 10,000. Anyway, guys, I thank you, I thank you, I thank you. Um, we are here doing a general reading for Capricorn. This is for the first week of December 2021. It is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Capricorn, I've already prayed, saved your cards. Shuffling, trying to get an overall energy. Look like you're working hard. You're just focused. You're moving out of, you know, you've been through something. You moved away from that. You focused on yourself with this nine of pentacles and the eight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. You working, working, working. Money looking good. You looking very stable. Very stable. Nine of pentacles. That's that's good. Yeah, you're happy right now. You're happy being single and doing your thing. You happy about that. Yeah, I like it. Ooh-wee. Yeah, you have cut things out that no longer serves you. The queen of swords. Look at you. Being all successful. Getting a lot of attention. Looking good. Smelling good. Taking care of yourself. Because when I was shuffling, the queen of cups came out. You're very intuitive and you're taking care of yourself. You're definitely taking care of yourself with the six of wands at the bottom of the deck. And at the bottom of this other deck that I shuffled, you Queen of Pentacles, there you is. Ooh, you got a new person? You've ended a cycle here, starting something new. Do you got a new person? You've ended things with people in your past. You probably got a new person here. Let's see what the Romance Angels come out with. Romance angels, what do you have for Capricorn? What do you have for Capricorn? What's going on with Capricorn? Oh, I saw that deception. Yeah, you're doing a lot of healing. What did I just say? You guys got new love. New love popped out. And you got rom you got romantic feelings for somebody? Or they got romantic feelings for you? You're going through a whole lot of healing here. You've done a lot of healing. You got a new love here. Look, it popped out. And I said, some of y'all got a new person here. And sure enough, new love came out. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. And you got a lot of chemistry with this person. Ooh. 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 Let's see. Why is healing family issues here? Why is healing family issues? Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. You've definitely cut things out that no longer serve you. You're looking happy and you're happy with somebody here too. Let's clarify these three right quick. What is this that popped out? Mm, the Knight of Wands. You could have been dealing with somebody that was in and out. That this person was not not as a was non-committal. Why is healing family issues here? Why is healing family issues here? The seven of cups. Yeah, this person was confused. They had a lot of options. So, but you're over that. That's the past. Why, who is this new love? Who is this new love for Capricorn? Who is this new love, guys? Okay, we got three cards. Okay. This one flew out. Look. 
the king of cups Ooh, look what's at the bottom of the deck the ace of cups can y'all see that the ace of cups and you got the king of cups here somebody got some emotions for you they're not probably expressing it to you but somebody is really really feeling you somebody is really digging you this person got romantic feelings for you and y'all chemistry is is, is 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 yeah it's good the chemistry is good this person got emotions for you and then you have the ten of wands um somebody here is willing to pull their weight somebody also could be burdened by something and we have the four pinnacles um what are you holding on so or maybe someone is still holding on to you capricorn but you moved on you have moved on somebody knows that you are a missed opportunity i think they still holding on to you and they're very burdened by it um wow tell me some more about this new love guys the three of pentacles this could be somebody, I mean, this is definitely someone that wants to collaborate with you. This person wants to work with you. Or maybe you work with somebody that you got romantic feelings with. Give me some more on this new love. Ooh, damn, that was fly one flying. Uh, we got the, the strength card and the hangman. You're controlling your emotions. It's, it's something at a standstill right now. Why is chemistry here? Why is chemistry here? The nine of cups and the five of cups. Someone definitely regrets the way they treated you. Somebody is still so in your energy right now, Capricorn. Somebody in your past. Somebody you ended something with. The ton of swords. They is still hanging on. This liar, this cheater is stressing out. Use your intuition. You're not stuck anymore mentally. You are not stuck anymore. Somebody feels that you're definitely their wish fulfillment and they regret the way they treated you. This is somebody that you have, you know, a lot of chemistry with, but you've ended it with this person, the world card. Yeah, this person was non-committal. Yeah, could have been a soulmate that you was dealing with. But you definitely got a new partnership here. But somebody is so in your energy right now, Capricorn. So in your energy right now. Let's take these up. And let's put down another, some more cards here for you. Let's see. Give me some more. What is the situation here for Capricorn? Yep, you got a new love and you're happy with this person. But you got somebody that is just trying to block you. I don't know. What is the situation here with Capricorn? What is the situation here with Capricorn? I see you cutting off anybody. I see you very, very, very blocked. You cutting off anything, you know, <laughs> that don't serve you. What is the situation here with Capricorn? Nine of Pentacles again, yeah. Looking good, smelling good, getting a lot of attention, very abundant. It's another card that fell here. The Queen of Swords again. You just ain't, you ain't having it. You are not having it. You are not letting nobody block your happiness. You're not doing it. The Queen of Swords is here twice. You are not doing it. No. What we got at the bottom of the deck? New love. Ace of Cups. This is the second Ace of Cups that I have that came out for you. This is new love. And some of y'all, I don't know. Are y'all reconciling with somebody? Are some of you guys going to reconcile with this, this person? What else for Capricorn? Um, the strength card. Mm -hmm. Somebody's losing it. <laughs> Somebody's out of control. Could be a Leo. We got the strength card in reverse. Someone can't control their emotions. Somebody is just losing it. What else you got here for Capricorn? The lovers could be a Gemini. This is someone that you got a very strong connection with. That's they, 
They having problems here. They having problems. They are having problems letting you go. What else we got here for Capricorn? The Queen of Wands. Hmm, who is this Queen of Wands? Somebody here is definitely wanting to take action. Someone here is very attracted to you. Look, the Knight of Wands. Somebody wants to have sex. <laughs> Somebody want to get with you. Somebody want to have sex. Bottom line. Bottom line. And they and they and they hate to see you with anyone else. This person do not want to see you with nobody else. Period. 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 They do not want you to move on. Somebody is having a hard ass time. Let's clarify this. Why is, yeah, Eight of Cups at the bottom of the deck? You definitely have walked away. Why is a Nine of Wands here? Yeah, you got to block yourself from this sneaky, shady-ass person, Seven of Swords. And that's what you're doing. You cut this person off. And they losing it. Queen of Pentacles, there you are. Mm-hmm. Stable, grounded, you know, handling your business. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here twice, guys? Why is it here twice? Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, you're doing a lot of healing. You're being patient. You're getting yourself balanced. I don't know. Some of y'all going to give somebody here a second chance, I'm feeling. What I'm hearing, too. Somebody, you're going to give somebody a second chance here. Um, I don't know if it's a good idea. A lot of you guys are happy with this new person. I think it's just a very few of y'all going to give somebody a second chance. But if I was y'all, of course, you got your own your own will. Do what you want to do. But somebody, we got temperance here. Here's judgment here at the bottom of the deck. We got this person holding on to you energetically. And I know you feel it because it is a very strong connection here. I think some of y'all going to give them another chance. This person is very attracted to you. Definitely wants to have sex. Maybe maybe y'all about to be intimate with this person. I know I see it here on the table. I know I see it here on the table. Because they're definitely coming at you very strong. Why is the Queen of Swords here twice? The Five of Pentacles. This person is feeling left out in the cold. This person didn't want to give you what you deserved. The, the Knight of Pentacles. They still, they took, they took their time. They still taking their time. I don't think you're going to get a commitment out of this person. I don't think you're going to get a commitment out of this person, Capricorn. Why is the strength card in the reverse? Why is the strength card in the reverse? Yeah, this person, <laughs> they about to call you quick, fast, and in a hurry. They are all over the place. They can't control their emotions for you. Um, the Queen of Cups, this person loves you. Queen of Cups, this person got emotions for you big time. And they about to tell you about them. They about to tell you how they feel. They about to tell you how they feel, but you better watch out. We got the Seven of Swords here on the table. Somebody could be coming towards you because they know you very abundant. They know you holding the bag because you are holding the bag. They know this. Look how this person is looking at, at, that, at, at this person, at your coins. Look how he's looking at your coins, this liar, this cheater, this thief. Look how he's looking at your coins, honey bun. Yeah, he knows that you're very abundant, knows it. Why is the lovers here? Why is the lovers here? Why is the lovers here? He done probably already took from you already. The Ten of Pentacles. person is wanting to build with you. It's probably what they're going to tell you. I think you're going to be building with a new person, too. Oh, the tower popped out here on the lovers. Yeah, something something wasn't stable, wasn't grounded in the family situation, and it went down. Because someone was loving on... There was two people here. We got we got a person, a non-committal person here. Knight of Wands is here on the table. It's here on the table. This is somebody that's in and out for sexual purposes only. And to get whatever they can get and steal whatever they can steal from you. Even if it's just your heart, your emotions. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
Yeah. But it looks like you're very guarded. It looks like you have boundaries. It looks like some of you guys have blocked this person, okay? And which is a good, as you should. It's a good thing. Some of y'all haven't because y'all going to let a man and y'all going to have sex with this person. Because you, can, you, you can't control your emotions. Queen of Wands. Why is this? Who is this Queen of Wands? Who is the Queen of Wands? Mm, the Ace of Cups. This person loves you. They are so attracted to you, though, but they sneaky as hell. They got feelings for you, but they sneaky as hell. Maybe you guys are taking action towards a new person. Some of y'all, like I said, is taking action towards this new person. You got, you got, some of y'all got romantic feelings for a new person, and y'all got a lot of chemistry. And the, and the passion is off the chain with this new person. Yeah, the passion is going to be off the chain. Yeah. Why well, is the Ace of Cups here? Some of y'all giving somebody a second chance because y'all can't control your emotions. Y'all going to give it up. Y'all going to give it up. Show sure is. Yeah, some of you guys are definitely moving forward. You're determined to move forward with someone new. Why is the Knight of Wands here? Why is the Knight of Wands here, guys? Okay, the Knight of Wands. Okay, so yeah, the death card. Somebody, okay. Somebody could be wanting to be on the up and up with you now. So that's for a few of y'all, okay? Somebody is ending their player ways here. Okay, yeah. Somebody is like wanting to wanting to start something new and and really, you know, be real with you. Some of y'all, that's for some of y'all. Because some you make somebody very happy. And some for some of y'all, y'all could have a family with this person and they want their family back. Okay. Somebody here wants their family back. And they're rushing in very, very, very quickly. Very, 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 very passionately. Okay. No doubt about it. For some of y'all, this new situation could lead to engagement. It could lead to something long term. It could lead to something long-term, Capricorn. Let's get an outcome. What is the outcome here for Capricorn? What is the outcome here for Capricorn? God, angels, ancestors, Holy Spirit. What is the outcome? Well, I keep seeing the Ace of Wands. I see y'all y'all ending something. And y'all taking a risk with somebody new. Yep, y'all walking away from somebody that stresses you, stress you out. Give me an outcome here, guys, for Capricorn. What's the outcome? Two more. One more. One more. Thank you. Thank y'all. Y'all is just too good to me. And I love it, love it, love it. Yeah, you're about to invest in somebody new. You're turning your back on somebody old. And you're investing in somebody new. And this is going to grow. You see all these weeds? This is going to grow. This is going to grow. And some of y'all are turning y'all back with someone that you've been investing in. Okay, we have the high priestess. Use your intuition. Okay, use your intuition. And we have the eight of wands because you're about to get some communication, and you need to, and you're gonna need to read between the lines and with this communication. It's some passionate communication coming in here because somebody definitely wants to get with you. You are you already know this is somebody in your past that wants to come in and have sex with you. Yeah, they want to apologize to so you. see that pig up there? And some of y'all going to be like, yeah, when pigs fly, get on out of my face. Like, you nope, know, you ain't getting no more of this. You can't have no more of this. No, no, and no. You, you done. No, 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 no. I got a new one. This is for my new boo. This is for my new boo, so leave me alone. Go on about your little, your little, with your little nasty ways. You feel me, y'all? Keep it moving. Y'all Y'all better stick with this. Y'all better get with this new person. Because this new person, yeah. Mm-hmm. A lot. It's going to be a lot of love here. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of love. So, Capricorn, this is what I have for you. If you resonate, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you, guys. Bye.